What's up guys? My name is Greg and I've got this request from one of our clients to build them a mini bar. And today I'm going to show you exactly how I've built it. Let's go. Now the client I'm specifically going to build this mini bar for requested specific measurements. And we're going to start off by cutting all our pieces of wood to size. Let's go. pieces of wood has been cut to size. Now I'm going to join my pieces of wood together using my biscuit jointer. Let's go! Now my glue ups is all done, while I'm waiting for my wood pieces to dry, I'm going to move on by cutting all my pieces of steel to size. Then we're moving on to welding. Let's go!
all my pieces of steel have been cut to size. I've cleaned all my edges and we're going to start off by welding two rectangular squares. Let's go. Now the bottom shelf, I specifically want to install the wine bottles. Now I was thinking to put the bottom wood at a slight angle where I'm going to cut some inserts where I can countersink my wine into the wood. Let's go.
all my inserts that's been cut into my wood and I honestly think it came out super great. Now I'm going to sand all my pieces of wood starting with 120 grit moving to a 220 grit and then ultimately finishing it with a 320 grit sandpaper and after the pieces has been sandpapered I'm going to router all my edges and then we're going to install all our pieces of wood into my steel frame. Let's go! Now the only thing left is to apply two coats of clear matte varnish. Let's go!
super happy with how this mini ball came out. And for all our South African fans out there, I've launched a new site, Craft House, where we're specifically only going to focus on building and selling of custom-made furniture. I am going to leave a link down in the description where you can find us and support us. And this is all for today, guys. Before you go, make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit the notification button so you don't miss out on any future projects or videos I'm posting. Cheers for now.